Images of the wildfires that ravaged Bastrop County still bring chills to those who live through it. But new tonight, what if something could have been done to prevent the fire from spreading? KITV's Fred Cantu says scientists are actually working on a new way to stop wildfires in their tracks. Yes, Judy, with Central Texas as dry as it is, it is scary to see any little piece of the countryside go up in smoke. But this fire in southern Bastrop County today was set on purpose as part of an experiment. And if it works, it could help keep you safe from future wildfires. Go ahead. This prescribed burn is pulling double duty. Along with helping Mother Nature revitalize areas with new growth, it's also helping to test a new natural fire retardant. If it works, it will be a big improvement over chemical retardants blamed for fish kills. This product doesn't have those issues of toxicity. It's a lot uh, more environmentally safe. Uh, it's good for the plants. It's good. It actually kind of has a protein capability, and it's just cornstarch. This test on a remote Bastrop County ranch brings back memories of the 2011 Labor Day wildfires that scorched thousands of acres and destroyed 1,700 homes. Those memories are especially vivid for one crew member at today's controlled burn. And I was a frontline firefighter on that as well. I uh, saw how it affected many, you know, and my own home was evacuated during that while I continued to fight fires. Today's test resulted in tons of data gathered on the ground and from the air. But the initial results indicate this new fire retarded did succeed in cooling down the areas where it was applied. What that means is that you wouldn't have back build of fires, you wouldn't have embers and things of that nature that are going to create that fire or cause that fire to reignite. And the product tested today is called Tetra KO. It expands in heat to smother the fire, and it also releases steam, which also smothers the flames. It is cool stuff in more ways than one. Fred Cantu, KITV News.